again. Do it again. <laughs> no, no. I can't do it again. Okay, okay. Uh, where is the best place to meet? The locals. To, to meet the locals, you should definitely go to Yakomini Platz. The best way to date to date the uh, yeah. locals. Yeah. 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 You should definitely go like to Lenhaplatz. Oh my God! Or Hauptbahnhof. Wow. Hauptbahnhof. It's an that amazing place. place. Like there are always so many people on a yeah. Sunday. It's a like to find Hopano? Yeah. Want some hair to be honest, the help and hope they're only like really rich people, you know? Yeah. All, like all of them wear their Louis Vuitton, so yeah. Where, where is it exactly? In the Hopano. old town? Like, no, no. Like, the, like the big train station. Yeah. Uh, the big train station? Yeah. Oh, okay. okay. All, the, like, all the rich people all go the on a Sunday. All the people live there. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah. Hot girls, if you know what I mean. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, it's a really safe area. Okay, there you can be able to meet some yeah. some yeah. locals Please, there. Lads. Oh my god, it's so <laughs> oh, <laughs> yes. that is cool. Yeah. That is cool. Have, have you tried Duna yet? Like Not Duna? Oh my god, you have to. Oh my god, it's like the, it's the best creation ever. And really? Yes. Like yeah. no, and genuinely, hands down. Really? Yes. Yeah. Oh. It's amazing. It's really good. Yeah. So it is in the um, train station around no, the train station? No, it's, it's everywhere. Everywhere? Yeah. Okay, what, what is the name well, of the kebab? If you, if you okay. go down there, D, then you, no, okay, you, you don't can go kebab. anywhere. Yeah, D, anywhere. O with the two dots, N, E, R. Oh my god, go okay, to I'll try Ifri. It. Ifri. It's, it's yeah. like the... <laughs> you, can get, you can get the best <laughs> doing there. It's okay. amazing. And what? Come up there, it's open 24 hours. Do you? Thank you, guys. Yeah, have an amazing time. Have an amazing time. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Guys, I'm right here with the pretty queens of Austria. Uh, Hi. I've talked a lot a little bit. They are from German Austrians and been almost two years been here. Tell us more about you. Who are you? Tell us more. Maybe for my followers and subscribers to know a little bit about you guys. Okay, um, so we moved here two years ago to study and yeah, that's kind of it. And now we're living our life here. And it's a really nice city, so... The architecture is really pretty, culture is really nice, a lot of cafes, a lot of parks, a lot of green space for a big city, so yeah. What city are you guys from, from Germany, for example? Uh, Western Germany, kind of. It's like a really small city, that's why. Yeah. Yeah, nobody knows it really. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's like a really small city. Wow. Yeah. So, I want to know, my subscribers want to know, what is the best way to meet you guys? In order to be able to get the date, you know, like in Austria, in general. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know. Like you can just talk to people easy here. I would yeah. say, like in summer, people are just hanging out outside and just relaxing, chilling. And I think the people are, yeah, easy to talk to here. Yeah, I'd say the same. It's like um, as long as you're open, as long as you're, you know, friendly, should be fine. Not everyone here is, well, they're not known to be the nicest people, usually, mm -hmm. but why not? Like, if you don't shoot your shot, you know, you won't be successful anyway, so. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> also, there are, like, many bars and pubs and clubs where you can just hang out also during the week, like, not, not always uh, at the weekend. So, yeah, it's, it's really cool here. Mm -hmm. yeah. We like it here. Shoot your shot, guys. <laughs> Maybe you might win. <laughs> so I think she shared more about a um, little bit about the system here. Some people are not that so friendly, but hey, if you don't give up, you are a foreigner, you are the one that come to visit there. So you have to try to keep on going. If one said, said no, you keep on going to the, the second one. 
until the second one, the next one, the next one, until maybe you find one that said yes. Yeah, as long as you're friendly, I think people are also friendly to you, so. So what is the best way we can be able to meet you guys? In the club, in the park? Yeah, I would say. Yeah, cafes maybe. Yeah, coffee sh Sure. <laughs> <Coffee>. <laughs> no, like a face, like a face. Where, yeah, we can like, drink coffee. Yeah. <laughs> that's what I meant. Face, yeah. yeah, that's like a typical thing in yeah. Austria that you just meet to drink coffee. Yeah, or drink early, you know. Yeah. Wow. And one thing I, I, I also observe if you're around them, living around them, as soon as they know you more, correct me if I'm not right, mm. I think if you spend time here and maybe in school or maybe you're working and if they know you as time goes or they know you more they will be more begin to be hopeful to be more friendly i think yeah mm -hmm. we agree on that i think yeah. i yeah. think i i sense that also and through my interviews so this is how it goes here i have tested i've experienced you know how i do my things if you are trying to talk to them in the main streets sometime it's not going to be easy for you to get someone to respond to you. Yeah. But if you are in the heart of the city, like the park we are here, or maybe in the coffee bar, or maybe discotheque, you know, even those places for me personally, I don't like going there because when they are going there, they are with their group. So mm -hmm. sometimes they are kind of shy, even though they are interested in you, most of them are shy to even to, like, to be open to talk to you. Yeah. And sometimes, yeah. Sometimes. Not everyone have, not all of them have the confidence to be able to like open up to like yeah. share with you and be able to exchange contact when they are in midst of their friends. So you can meet them in quiet places and uh, talk to them. Whoever that is interested can be open up to know you. Yeah. So guys, thank you very much for sharing. You're welcome. Any additional <laughs> information you want to share to help my guys? Greets to France. Yeah, greetings. <laughs> greetings. <laughs> Okay. Greetings to France. Exactly. Greetings to France. Okay. <laughs> but anyway, I'm from Nigeria, so greetings to Nigeria. Greetings, greetings to, to Nigeria, Nigeria also. <laughs> uh -huh. Nice. So thank you very much. Yes. No problem. Bye. Bye. Thank you. <laughs> Hi. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Great. I'm right here with one of the pretty queens of Austria. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> You're welcome. So, I want to know. Anyway, tell me more about you. Are you from uh, Vienna? No, I was actually born in Carinthia. That's like pretty close to the Italian border of okay. Austria. But I'm studying here. Oh, so nice. I'm a student, yeah. For how long? Um, about a year now. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Cool. You like it here? Yeah? yeah, I love Can you it. Tell me about the, the, the beautiful city of Vienna. So Vienna is, in my opinion, the prettiest city in Europe. Oh. I, I really like it here. We have a lot of nature and a lot of art and culture. So I really like it. I like the mixture of everything. Oh, that is great. Nice. Thank you for sharing with my <laughs> subscribers and viewers. You're welcome. Nice. I want to know, what is the best way to date An the Austria? pretty queens of Austria? Um, well, I think it's not that hard actually. I think most Austrian girls, especially in Vienna, are pretty open-minded. So they are 
very approachable, I would say. So just come up and be respectful, be nice. Don't be too pushy. Just come up, say, hi, how are you? And then it's going to be fine. But if she doesn't answer or if she gives you like a weird look or something, then just leave it because the girls who are interested will be interested if you're nice. But if they don't, then don't be too pushy because we don't like that. <laughs> yeah, I think girls who like you will make it easy for you to date them. Yeah, for sure. So in what way, for example, you mean we can approach direct in the street or maybe... Yeah, I mean, um, it really depends. If she, for example, if she has her phone in her hand, mm. then she's probably busy. Then that's like a bad timing. But if she's in the park mm. or if she's sitting somewhere and drinking a coffee and you see she has a lot of time, then maybe approach her. But don't if she like... across. As a, don't approach her when she goes across the street or if she's waiting for the subway because then she's probably busy. Okay, anyway, thank you very You're much. You're welcome. Hi! How are you? Great. Fine. Sunny. No, nice. It's sunny, yeah. That perfect. Is why you are enjoying the perfect weather right here in Vienna. <laughs> yes. What is the name of this thing? This monument here? Flakturm. Flakturm, it's called. It's called. Uh, yeah, yeah, it was for the Second World War. Okay. It was like a <laughs> defensive base. Oh. You know, so they have high ground, basically. Girls, I have a question for you. Yes. What is the best way to date an Austrian woman as a foreigner? <laughs> I came I in, date. maybe I want to like date a foreign, uh, an Austrian woman. How can I meet her? Mm, maybe in bars. Okay. <laughs> uh, in bars or uh, on social media. Okay. I think many awesome. girls are now on social media. Nice. Dating apps. Yeah, dating apps. Mm -hmm. Like what? Like Bumble, Tinder. <coughs> nice. Okay. nice. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much for sharing. You're no welcome. problem. You're welcome. <laughs> Hello, excuse me, are you from Austria? Yes. Good, can you share with me in 30 seconds in my YouTube channel, yeah. what is so unique and so special about your city grass? Ooh, um, that's a good question. Mm -hmm. <laughs> share with us, we want to learn, yeah. my subscribers want to learn too, <laughs> I want to learn too, right. and viewers. Um, well, we've got very old architecture okay. and lots of um, red. What are they called? Red tiled roofs. Okay. Which are very nice to see from, from the top. It's not oh. a very hilly city. Okay. But there is one 
mountain, I guess you call it. That one over there? Um, yeah, that's kind of outside of the city, but there's one in the center. Ah, it's this really, way. Really nice. Okay. Yeah. So I should, you should definitely check that out because you've got a great view of the whole um, skyline, pretty much. Oh, right you there. are the first uh, Austrian that can be able to uh, share, stand and share our opinion and the uniqueness of our city and to express ourselves direct in the street. So respect to you, girl. Thank you. What is the best way to date an Austrian woman? I'm a foreigner. I just came around or other student that is yeah. coming. Maybe at some time they want to go out to meet the locals, you know, yeah. to have some friends. Yeah. How can we do it? I'm not sure. Some people said you can talk to them direct in the streets yeah. or online. Well, it's, I don't know. Club, I feel like a club. lot of people are very um, cautious. So, um, they are very I'm cautious. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is what I can. What can you tell me more about your people? Some said uh, they prefer to like meet some guys in the bar, in the restaurant, maybe right in the street. And you were saying something. You said that you guys are pretty little bit more cautious. Yeah. So tell me more about that. I don't know. I, well, just I can on, only speak for my friends and myself. Mm -hmm. um, and we're quite cautious because a lot of us have had, have had bad experiences with foreign people enough. in the street. No, not just foreigners, just everyone. Okay, in the um, street. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so we're, we're quite, yeah safety oriented i'd say okay so talking to strangers that we don't know no matter if they're from like our hometown or anywhere else in the world is quite scary sometimes just because you don't know who you're meeting mm. um but i don't know for, for dating I'm, I'm i'm drawing blanks i honestly don't know i have no no plans no okay name some of the Point out some of your experience in the streets with unknown guys. Well, I've been uh, verbally harassed a lot. Thanks. <laughs> I've just been verbally harassed a lot, so I'm quite cautious when walking by myself. Um, and you see, guys, when you talk to her, you like her, you talk to her, and maybe she's an Ori, uh, or maybe she don't really like your style, you started insulting her. So this is the, this is it. Yeah. Pretty it's much. not good. Yeah. So you make her now, you make all the beautiful women now to become cautious when they are out. Exactly. Yeah. So because of that, now you are, you guys are a little bit cautious of the kind of person you are talking to in the street. Yeah, a lot of the time, which is quite sad because I love, I love meeting new people, and mm -hmm. it's really, I don't know, it's it's sad that experiences like that make me close you like it less. Yeah. Yeah, it's like. A, that push you to become more closer. Yeah, exactly. Open your heart once more. Yeah. And then you can descend. Try to like, read. I know it's not easy, but try to observe before you, you give it. Better. Of course, yeah. yeah. But it's good because I like spontaneously. Because that is where the true story lies. You know, like some people say love stories or whatever. It's good. But if it, like it's too st structured, like friends from friends or someone you already know, it's like, like some degree you are waiting for it yeah so it's not that so intriguing mm -hmm. but when in the street maybe you just like oh, you just meet a cool gentleman and talk to you very well and maybe it leads to something interesting it is fine anyway so guys because of that they are a little bit close so what option we can be able to meet you guys i wouldn't know <laughs> you don't know maybe true friends know. or in school yeah probably yeah that's how i meet most people Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much for sharing. You're welcome. She's brave. The first, the first Austrian to be able to talk to me in the street. That I stop direct and talk to me. <laughs> she deserves well. some like and subscribe. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Bye bye. Yeah. So it is awesome. It is interesting. And uh, finally, this is what happened. This girl has shared very important things that many women are scared of that makes many women to shut up completely from talking to people in the street. So don't make them to run away. But I know whenever they still meet a gentleman, they will still stand.
and still hear from him because we have different vibe. Real men have different vibe, like the way she stand and share. So, but the ones that are really, really traumatized a lot, it is difficult for them to even to say I. So even to look into your eyes before you can be able to cap capture their attention. So for them to stand to conversation, with, uh, to have a conversation with you. So guys, if you talk to a woman in the street, if she didn't like, or if she's in order, she didn't respond, don't insult her because you are doing yourself more harm, not them, because they will be more close. So, hello, excuse me. Are you from Austria? No. Where are you from? Ukraine. Oh, Ukraine. Okay, this one I will be Ukraine. Thank you. <laughs> so, this is it, man. I hope I can be able to put out the message correctly, the way I really want to put out the message, so that we men, we should know that some of the things we are doing is not helping us. So, here we go. I am Joel Tamara. If you like my videos, please hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification so you will get notified of my upcoming videos as I take you to every country on head. Until then, have a wonderful and inspiring day. Bye-bye.